Missouri. With nearly 45 million acres located in America's heartland, is an area of much diversity in its people, resources, and its agriculture. The USDA's Natural Resources Conservation Service is here to help preserve, protect, and improve our state. Hi, I'm J.R. Flores. I have the privilege of being the NRCS State Conservationist in Missouri. They call this the Show Me State. By the time I've been here, I am the one whose eyes have been opened to how beautiful and diverse this state is. Missourians are fortunate to have such rich natural resources right outside our doors. Here's a glimpse into what makes Missouri so special. Missouri is a leading agricultural state that produces a wide range of crops. It ranks in the top 10 in corn, soybean, sorghum, and rice production. These crops, plus wheat and cotton, produce receipts of more than $2 billion each year. Specialty crops such as pecans, grapes, peaches, apples, tobacco, and walnuts are also significant in economic value. Missouri produces more walnuts than any other state. Missouri ranks second in the nation in livestock production with significant beef cow, dairy, hog, and poultry industries. And the state's equine population is the third highest in the country. Missouri is roughly one-third cropland, one-third pasture and hayland, and one-third forest land. Missouri has an urban side as well, with St. Louis and Kansas City anchoring its east and west borders. Two of the world's largest rivers, the Missouri and the Mississippi, cut through and help frame the state. But Missouri is also known for its lakes and pristine rivers, springs, and streams. People come from everywhere to enjoy these natural resources. The state's wildlife resources also are envied throughout the nation. Many innovations in wildlife management for deer, turkeys, waterfowl, and non-game species originated here. Missouri's natural resources diversity includes a wide range of soils and topography found in very few states. Soil scientists have documented 600 different kinds of soils in the state. Unfortunately, a combination of highly erosive soil conditions that include steep fields, high intensity rainfall, and high intensity row crop production stresses Missouri's natural resources. Throughout much of the 20th century, Missouri had one of the worst soil erosion problems in the nation. But Missouri's erosion rate has dropped more than any other state over the past 25 years. During that time, the state's average soil erosion rate has been cut in half and is now just over five tons per acre on cultivated cropland. This progress is the result of action taken by Missouri farmers to put soil conservation measures to work on their land. Their conservation efforts have been aided by a sales tax approved by voters in 1984 that provides about $40 million each year 
to support local soil and water conservation efforts and an equal amount to maintain state parks. The progress also is a result of the great work of the professional conservationists who are dedicated to preserving the state's rich natural resources. NRCS has 99 field offices with 400 employees serving Missouri's 114 counties. Another 400 employees of partnering agencies also work out of NRCS offices. NRCS in Missouri is designed for customer service. As we look back over our first 75 years as an agency, it's obvious how far we've come since those early days. Today we have more programs than ever to help land users. The NRCS team in Missouri has emphasized soil conservation, wildlife habitat improvement, wetland restoration, management intensive grazing, forest management, and animal waste and nutrient management. The results have been positive and impressive. We are proud of the work that we are doing and we are looking to the future where we will focus on identifying more potential customers and on continuing to deliver high quality, value added programs and services. It is our mission to help people help the land and Missouri NRCS is ready for the challenge. Welcome to Missouri, a state rich in resources, a state working to keep it that way.